hello everyone welcome back so in this video I'm going to show you how to prepare your active direct your on-prems active directory for office 365 synchronization so as you can see here I have my uh, domain or active directory my user is in user OU so what I'm going to need to do is run the ID fix tools Let's launch um, Google and type in type in run the ID f the Office three sixty five ID fix tool. So let's click on the top one here. So this document shows you um, what you need to run. You would need a .NET uh, 4.0. It's a hardware requirement for gig of RAM, disk space. So now let's download the IDFix tools. Download it. Let's go to show folder. Let's extract the ID fix tools. And if you want to read more information on the ID fix guide or ID fix tools, here's a guide that you can view. I'm going to launch ID fix tool, run as administrator. If you, so here's nothing here. Um, when you click on queries, it's going to query your current Active Directory infrastructure. And here's some of the issues that it's currently seeing. Um, special character. It has a space here. So Office 365 does not allow you to have a um, space between the um, names here so as you can see it's recommended John Smith um, also the top level domain is errors that means it's non routable domain so it needs to be the the routable domain like the dot com dot org dot um, edu so now let's go ahead and fix these. I'm going to go to fix John Smith. Users with John Smith. Account. So I'm going to take out the space. I'm going to change this to the domain it's a routable domain you know what I'm gonna put uh, John dot Smith I'm gonna click apply click OK and I'm gonna fix the data name Terry Taylor go to properties account I'm going to take out the hyphen, change this to routable uh, name. Actually, I need to put a dot in here. All right, click apply. Now, let's rerun the ID fix tools. Click on query. So, the name has been fixed. There's two names that has been fixed. This is my test my service account so I'm not going to do anything with this one so that's it that's how you um, prepare your on-prem active directory before you sync them to the cloud make sure there's no more errors 
Um, once you do that, you can start by installing the ID fix. I'm sorry, by installing the AD Connect tools. The AD Connect, you can just type in AD Connect download. It's right here at the top. Click on that and click on download. So you can watch my other video, um, how to configure AD Connect. And if you have any questions, please feel free to ask me and put in the comment section. Thank you for watching and have a good day.